hi what's up how is it going today's video we are going to be creating you know uh an hand fan in corridor 2021 without further ado let's step into it you are making use of this picture so right now let's add on to it so right now what you're going to do is to go ahead and just make a copy of this uh click once again then you slant it to the other side slant it just like so and get a destination you release your uh mouse so after that make a copy downward right click to copy paste after that center it within the previous one then you go ahead come back to beach map then you hit ok so right now what you're going to do is to go ahead and just lens that with your what's it called transparency tool click on uniform transparency text you here so let's go ahead and pack clip this into place so let's adjust that after power clipping then let's go ahead and just bring in we are making use of this you know a picture and group that then you go ahead and power clip that into place so zoom up hold alt key and keyboard select the picture then you make it bigger just like so good so what we are going to do is to go ahead and just you know create uh, a object just like so then you change that out to white so what we are going to do now is to go ahead and just back clip this into place then adjust it just like so so after all of that so what we're going to do is to create object on top of it just like so then you change that to gold right click to set the outline to none then you make a copy downward after that select both objects group it all up ctrl g then you per clip go back to objects look at back clip place inside frame select the frame it takes you in so hold alt key select the objects adjust perfectly then you back clip into place back clip then you adjust send to back control p down then you adjust the, the picture just like so good so right now let's bring in the pre-design you know a 60 bed there position that so well go ahead and adjust that give it a brown shape so make it a bit wide then let's just go ahead and just bring in bed there so right now let's change this to white then you change the font to a uh, Futura C let's change to uh, square bits so right now make it cap to letter then you position that beneath it make it smaller then you go ahead with your shape to increase the tracking just like so then you position it beneath it so what we're gonna do now is to go ahead let's keep this you know a uh, drop shadow go back to shadow 2 apply shadow to that apply shadow
cut this off then you cut this off convert to bitmap then you go ahead apply shadow let's go to setting let's make that 100 percent then you go ahead and make this six it's okay then you go back to object break drop shadow apart group it all up so let's position it on top of this of the design good so right now what we are going to do is to go ahead and just uh, bring in the uh, the rest of the test just like so let's make use of other picture I think this picture is not uh, it does not suit the design so let's make use of this or better still this power clip adjust delete the previous one so right now let's adjust the design pull this up a little bit then you make grandpa a bit bolder so right now let's change the font to chequila good or better still let's use a uh, hello paris good make it bolder right click on white to set the outline to white then you go ahead it f12 let's make the thickness three that's too thick let's make it two it's okay good so right now let's go over and just you know reduce the tracking just like so after all of that then you go ahead to object locate you know convert outline to object automatically it's converted that then you group it all up wait up with that all up then you go ahead and just you know let's apply gradient effect with the help of uh, what's it called interactive field to double click right here so let's make this black good adjust that forward adjust that good so right click on white to set the outline to white so after that each f12 then let's make it you know one then check on scale with object then bind feel it's okay so after all of that let's give it a uh, shadow effects apply shadow go ahead and make the shadow 80 to make it darker then you go ahead and just you know break drop shadow apart it breaks then zoom down so right now our next step right now is to go ahead and just you know let's go ahead and just uh, the dates let's change the font to this enter from there enter good delete the comma so in this case let's make it you know all cap so right now let's go ahead to uh, click on shift tool then you reduce the tracking just like so give it a uh, right alignment good so let's uh, set the outline to black to make it a bit uh, you know clearer so right now let's it's okay from here enter from here then enter from here 
so what we're going to do now is to just you know create an object right here then let's sample this blue color right from here good point right here so go ahead to your shape tool let's round the corner all up just like so there you go ahead make a copy inward then you set the half line to white adjust it just like so after all of this hit f12 then you make the thickness one it's okay good but clip that into place then adjust good So right now what you're going to do is to power clip this as well into the object, adjust, then you go ahead, just uh, pull the test in, then you go ahead and make the test for two rati. It's okay, make it a bit smaller, then you go ahead and just make this bold then you set that so uppercase it's okay use your shape to reduce the tracking just like so good make it bigger a little bit good can you see that so let's just adjust this a little bit make it bigger adjust the picture a little bit adjust it good reduce that a little bit into uh, space good make it bigger good so go the line then hit F12 make it one point then you go ahead make it a dotted line it's okay good so make a copy click once again then you slant it just like so right click when you get this it's your destination then you adjust just like so good so can you see the outcome of what we created so far center it within that so here we come to the end to do it. don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel by clicking on the button below subscribe and don't forget to hit that like button so that other people can benefit from what we have shared so far see you in the next video bye for now